In today's tip for traveling Europe, don't bring a fuck. All right, everyone. After an amazing trip in Scotland, life was back to normal. I had some friends running a 5K, so I went to the event. It was fun. There was a little uh, car crash simulator, which was an uh, interesting thing to try. Then there was a birthday party, but otherwise just, yeah, normal life. One thing I've definitely been trying to do more of this year is sort of unique experiences or events. So a coffee festival with a very similar premise was right up my alley. festival, you know, for good measure. In Poland, warm weather, similar to most other places, usually means barbecue. Now for us, that means a few things. Beach, some kielbasa, beer, and of course, great times with friends. Barbecue day. Barbecue night, but we had a cookout today. It was beautiful. Really nice. so striking to me. I swear that I never seem to walk past and not shoot some footage. off to goodnight. With my travel buddy feeling under the weather, I went to get myself a snack and a drink to pass the time. Here's the train bathroom. I've been meaning to make it up here for basically a year and a half. So, yeah, it's about damn time. 
It's already so beautiful. Walked around a little last night, as you saw. But yeah, should be fun to explore during the day. I was so ready to take a cold bath in the Baltic Sea. I came prepared, I had a towel. I was like, it doesn't matter how cold I want to do it. And then it started hailing. So that was unfortunate. After a bit of meandering and some excellent lunch, we walked around Old Town some more, which eventually had us walking into St. Mary's Basilica. After some looking around, we decided to climb to the top. Like, the old town's really pretty, the river. Went up by the sea. Ah, uh, I really wanted to jump in. I think that's that part, kid part of me that would jump in Lake Superior when it wasn't even that warm. I did want to jump in, but I didn't. I was worried about getting sick. But, next time. city is so beautiful. I'm at the center street. It's very pretty. There's a lot of people. But it looks very cool. I feel like the best thing to do would have been to wake up really early and walk through here then. Because I did that in Prague and like Old Town's really cool when it's really empty, but, and it's still very cool now, but obviously it'd be really cool if it's empty, but, uh, you know, I did not wake up at five. Maybe I should have. We are getting coffee.
How would you rate Gdansk? Gdansk? Honestly, maybe like seven. Why? Because we came on the off season, I feel like. So, and, so and, what's and, wrong with it? Well, no, but what I'm saying is uh, at a certain point, right, we didn't even know what to do with ourselves. Now, maybe part of that is our fault because we didn't read ahead or watch anything ahead to really figure out what was needed. But the view... Don't listen to him. Gdańsk is beautiful. No, but There's, I, I have loved it. This is one of my favorite cities in Poland. But the view, the view from the St. Mary's Basilica, 10 out of, no, not even 10, 20, 20 out of 10, a billion out of 10. Beautiful. In today's tip for traveling Europe. Don't bring a fucking suitcase. Yeah, I learned that one uh, last year. I hear it's fine, but then you, you forget that uh, most of Europe is cobblestone, not nice places. So bring a backpack, folks. A backpack is uh, better way to do it. Thank you.